Hello friends and welcome to YouTube channel Freedom Tech and in this session what we are going to learn. In this session we are going to create object detection and counter for images. So before we move to our practical friends if you learn something from our videos please consider to subscribe our channel. Ok friends thank you so much and let's get started. So friends in this session we are going to detect object also we are going to create a counter uh, for images using YOLO weird. So simple for that just open Tony Python ID and first we are going to install our basic packages so manage packages go to the tools manage packages opencv hyphen python this is how we install opencv on our windows machine so opencv hyphen python click on install that's it it will install opencv then we need ultra ultralytics package ultralytics so just hit enter first package ultralytics click on install that's it it will install ultralytics then cv zone hit enter cv zone package click on install just it will in install the cv zone on our windows machine so for today's session i have created yellow weird object counting image this is the repository i will mention the link copy paste the link inside the browser then go to the core click on download zip and it will create our zip format repository that's it so minimize all these things and then open the folder downloads and then right click to the repository winrar and extract with the folder name it will create a folder you know weird count image same folder again and first we need our images so inside that i have mentioned some images so images.zip right click winrar and extract to images so it will create images folder again images and then we have some images here it is as you can see we have bus again bus person so we have motorcycle person we have truck then we have some cars so our goal is to detect the objects also we are going to create a counter means for this image as you can see we have here cars and we have here number of cars let's say 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so our goal is to detect the object also our goal is to count how many cars we have inside this image simple so for that i have created a code already here it is as you can see our coco.txt file which is basic file if i open inside that we have our objects class names then let's just open test.py with our thony python ide so if you follow my channel then you definitely know how we use yolo v8 with opencv python for object detection so same code here same code here it is as you can see this is how we detect our objects now we have our x1 y1 x2 y2 rectangle coordinates then object class here it is as you can see then we are going to simply we are going to append the class list here it is as you can see object class append and inside that we are going to append the class when we detect a classes from images we are going to simply create uh, the list so obj class here it is as you can see this variable is basically represent our class list so obj class obj classes append and here it is i have create empty list so inside that list when we detect the object of course it will detect the cars from image and then it will send the classes name inside that list so for this list now we have classes names simple then here this is what our function as you can see def object and inside that i have passed the object which is img image and then we are going to simply call our object class return return object classes now we can simply call our list anywhere so here it is as you can see this is what our counter function for counting the object inside images each image we have different objects and we have different numbers of objects so simply we have we want to create a function so dev count object in image simple and inside that basically what we are going to count we are going to count here a number of classes in particular image so here our object is basically object classes so inside that this function represent our classes then counter is just a variable 
and we have a by default module which is counter here it is as you can see c capital counter so this counter will basically count the number of classes or we can say the number of list object so counter inside that we want to pass our list which is object classes here it is as you can see and then the counter function will count the classes from our list so simply print object count in image then inside that inside this counter we are going to use counter dot items so for obj means the for object and then count for obj and count in this counter dot items then we are going to simply print the object and the count here it is as you can see simple and then now we have multiple images inside our folder so we want to read each image one by one for that we have here a globe module import globe module this globe module will basically uh, use for reading the multiple images here it is as you can see for file in globe dot globe and then we want to mention the path of our folder where we have all our images and here it is one more thing friends for this function for this count function here it is as you can see we want to simply mention the by default function which is from collection import counter import counter from collection module this is the module and we are going to import a counter from this module simple so then we have here as i mentioned we want to mention here our images folder path so let's just open the repository this is what our images and this is what our main folder inside that we have our all images so we want to mention this folder path so just copy as a path and mention it here just remove and just press ctrl plus v remove this double colon here also as you can see remove this double colon now it's good now this is what our full path for reading our images and this star dot star is basically read all the images from our folder one by one that's it then simply as i mentioned for file we want to use here a for loop so for file in globe dot globe we want to mention the path and then our basic code for reading the images img is equal to c2 dot imread and inside that we want to pass this file then we are going to resize our img then object classes just a variable is equal to our function this function this function is for detecting the object from our image using yellow weight so we want to call the function over here here it is as you can see object and inside that what is our object our object is basically img pass the img then we want to we detect our object then we want to count the object so for counting object we want to call our count object in image function here it is as you can see count object in image function and inside that our object is for counting our object is basically object classes we detect object here it is as you can see we detect object and then inside that we have object classes list so we want to pass that function over here count object in image object classes and then c2 dot show method then wait key and then destroy all windows simple code okay so now just run the code first it will download our pre-train object detection model which is yellow v8 s dot pt so as you can see it's now downloading so friends as you can see this is what our first image and for this image as you can see it's detected the object which is the car one two three four five six seven and inside the shell as you can see for this image object count in image cars and the number of cars is basically seven so for this image we detect the car and the number is basically seven so we have seven cars in this image the first image now simply press a space button and then it will go for next image so for this image as you can see we have one truck and here it is as you can see the truck detected and the number of truck is basically one so we have one truck for this image 
then we have here one truck and one car so truck is one car is one for this image one two two truck and one car truck two car one for this image we have three motorcycle three person motorcycle three three person for this image we have one bus so bus is one for this image we have one two three one two three so three person and three buses for this image we have two buses bus two that's it i have shared full code with images and for custom model you need to simply create your own custom model for your requirement for counting objects in images i hope you learned something from this video we'll meet our next video till then thank you take care and bye bye